everybody Ann here sitting out in front of the chicken yard outside because it's already starting to get hot and it's supposed to rain a little bit later today. So I'm going to see if I can at least get one of those posts up. <laughs> I don't know how much more energy I have than to do one, but I need to at least try this new post pounder thing that Donna B got me and uh, see if I can do it by myself without anybody's help. I had to put the Easter eggers inside their little coop while I work on this. Um, I've got a number of posts left. I'm not sure this is exactly how I'm going to do the layout. I'm just going to get one in first and see if I can do it. And I'll use the tree as a stake here. Um, and then i got a couple more over here. Three more, actually. Um, so I don't know. I'm just going to have to see how much... How much uh, fencing I have too, but at least today I'm going to get in one of these stakes. And so I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to try and see if I can get this one in right about here. Wish me luck. For the sake of not making this video way too long, I'm condensing this, just a couple clips, so you can kind of get an idea that, yep, this post pounder, whatever you call it, is absolutely fantastic, and I can handle it on my own. I'm very proud of myself, even though I was really tired, I got a couple post pounded in all by myself. Great. It started raining. It was really weird because I heard it in my woods first. You could hear it coming, but I was over by where I was doing the chicken thingy, and um, I could hear it coming. <laughs> it's just very light. Hopefully it'll blow by. I got two posts put up, and I need to get that yard put together, put back together safely before I let the chickens out so they don't elope. So, right now, let's see how long it's going to rain. I did get it all covered back up. I had to reconnect things in several places because it was all different shapes and sizes. But it's up a little bit higher. It makes it easier for me to get in there and walk around. So I've only got two posts in. Um, I don't know. Four or five more left to go. I'll just be glad when I can extend this part up. Um, and then I'm not going to be using this for the sides. Um, I'm going to be hopefully putting some more chicken wire up all around like I did in the other yard so um, well at least I got two up that one I I couldn't even get all the way down to the ground but I don't care it's still stable enough um, and once I get it high enough then I can just put this weird deer knitting stuff just over the top of it maybe I don't know we'll see but at least they're safe and um, at least I've got it started a lot more work left to do a lot more chicken wire um, I've got some chicken wire left over so um oops there's a little hole there so i'll see how much i've got and uh, we'll just uh well get her done eventually hopefully there's one thing the poor easter eggers don't have a lot of access to so i noticed when i had pulled this fence out just a little bit more they had access to more of this green stuff so i just picked them a whole bunch of greens and toss it into the yard let's see if i can do this with one hand and film at the same time let's see if i can get it through this little spot in the fence and they really love it there you go Calm down whoops those trays have seen better days i try and get them an assortment of all different kinds of greens and this will be gone in the period of about Oh, 10-15 minutes. You're 
welcome. Look at how absolutely gorgeous they are. Oh my gosh. They heard something. <laughs> Enjoy, ladies. Since this had all kind of, you know, evaporated or drained or whatever, I decided before it starts raining too hard to just dig a few more inches. And that's what I've done. I got a few more inches. I've kind of cleaned out this thing. It needs to be cleaned out better and dug deeper um, because it's still going this way out where I walk. I want to train it to go kind of this way in between the logs. So um, I'm getting tired and it's going to be raining any second here again. So I think I'm just going to leave this here. I would really like the pond to be about a foot deeper. It needs to be deeper here too so that it doesn't just start overflowing because I want all of this to to fill up too. So um, I need to dig that deeper. That area over there, that's all going to be part of the pond. I'm going to dig that out because the water comes out from this hill right here. It's like weird from a little hole. It just comes out. And uh, this is pretty awesome because the chickens love to go in here and get a little uh, a little drink when there's water in it. So, yeah, it's, it doesn't look like much now, but when it's done, it is going to be absolutely beautiful. You know what I'm going to do next? I'm heading out to the shed. I am going to fire up that generator, and I am going to sit inside in the cool air conditioning. Yep, it started to rain again. So Torch and his flock, actually I think there's two roosters. That one, and that one, and we may have another one right there. <laughs> I don't know. I definitely think Torch is a rooster, and I think the one on the left is a rooster, and to the right of that, I think that may be a rooster as well. I don't know, you tell me. But they're all, they're all skedaddling back into the the yard area where they know that they can take shelter. Aww, and Miss Pris has her little baby chickens up underneath of that little shelter there. They're so cute! And what would a video be if it didn't include Papa? Yes, you're my sweet boy. Before too long, you're gonna have a little puppy over here. And then we got to get you fixed. <laughs> this has turned out to be the best dog. He is very well mannered. He doesn't always come to me when I call him, but if I've got treats in my hand, and he's got plenty of treats now, don't you, Papa? If I got treats in my hand, he knows there's something good inside that bag, so he'll come if I have the bag in my hand. So that's kind of a good thing. It did start raining again, so I'm just sitting out here <laughs> in the rain. It's just sprinkling underneath my canopy, enjoying my beautiful chickens. Oh, look, one of the babies is getting off by itself. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Anyway, so, you know what? I think that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video.
thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.